All right, uh, welcome back. We've got a few more cases for you to uh, check out. I think there's like seven or eight, so uh, let's jump on in. First one's here. Um, clearly, there wasn't enough space here. Um, so, but there was one thing here that I wanted to check is, is that marginal ridge. So, we're going to go ahead and fix that. Let's just raise this whole thing up. It's always better to squeeze it in and then cut them. Let's make sure. Yep. Okay, okay. There we go. Sorry for the uh, noise in the background. Not sure if you guys can hear it or not. Okay, that one's good. And we'll save. All right, this one looked pretty good. Um, maybe a hair bulky there on the buckle, but. Oops, wrong button. Okay, let's just go ahead and bring this in just a little bit. It's always better to err on the side of less bulky. Alright, contact. Let's just. I always paint and make it zero. I want that speckled look on the contact area. Okay, that one looks great. Save next. Right here we go. Um, this one looks really, really nice. The hair bulky here on this mesolingual cusp, maybe a little bit down here. Um, cusp placement looks great. Marginal ridges, it's really the best you can do. Okay. Let's bring this in a hair. There we go. Smooth it out just a just a bit. A little bulky here. Let's just bring this in. Okay. Looks good there. Good there. Context. We need to add a little bit to this contact. Just give them nice broad contact areas. Nice broad. And change the contact. There we go. Cut. Uh, and then smooth this out, round this corner a little bit more to match. The other ones. Perfect. All right. That one's good. Move on to the next one. This one we're gonna skip. We need to call the doctor to see if they wanted to um, get that contact over there or not. They didn't write it down in the prescription. Uh, so we'll just go ahead and skip this one for now. Here, this one was really nice. I think just a hair bit bulky here on this buckle. Go ahead and 
and scoot this in. Okay, everything else looks really nice. Marginal ridges, maybe make this contact a little bit more broad. Okay. one. I think this is the one where the buckle cusps are a bit short. Nope, it's not this one. There's one where the buckle cusps are a bit short. I'll show you that in a second. This one's good. Um, again, just a little bulky. And you see the prep. I kind of follow the contours of the prep. Um, and always look down the line. Just a little bulky on that buckle. Just a lot of grinding to do and we don't want to grind on zirconia. now it's fine uh, marginal ridge looks good contact looks pretty good I come over here a little bit more okay good there these cusps probably should have gotten this cusp up in there a little bit more here on the lingual so let's just do this whole thing let's get contact see where you're at all right there we go and then this out. Oh, wrong one. Okay, so that looks nice to me. Now we'll go ahead and cut. Yeah, okay, and then drop it down. Contacts. good. Next one. Save that. Alrighty, here we go. Uh, first thought, anatomy. I know there wasn't a whole lot of space on this one. Uh, let's see if I can pull it down and take this. Show up. Okay. Um, yeah, there wasn't. There's not a whole lot of space. There's not much you can do here, but overall, uh, looks really nice. Uh, let's see here. Looks pretty good. Again, maybe that buckle. That's not. Yeah. Mm. Maybe. I'd probably bring it in just a hair. I always. Again. Just a little bit. Other than that, this crown looked great. I like that one a lot. Nice contours. Um, Getting to go there. Okay, here's another one. Um, I like that you guys. Oh, is this the one that I did already? Or is this a similar one? Yeah, let's check these lingual. Yeah, okay, here's one where you need to roll in these lingual cusps a little bit. Oop. And also, it's nice to just um, design these cases without the jaw scan. It'll really help you see. See that? I guess you can't really roll that in too much. Use the um, take away the jaw, so you can see, you know, this kind of stuff. With this jaw scan here, it'd be, you can't see this stuff. You can't see certain angles, so it's always nice to take away that jaw scan. All right, let's smooth this up. Again, not no space on this one either, but looks nice. So let's make sure these contacts are nice and broad. that in. 
end over there in a second. Okay, let's adapt here. Alright. Now let's look straight down the line. Roll this. Oh, wrong way. Just. Gosh darn it. Roll that in. What do you think? Sound like fun? Perfect. All right. Cool. And is there another one? I think there is another one. Here's the one with the cusp. So you can see right here. Kind of want to get short. So we're going to bring this one down. Everything else looked pretty gr pretty good, except for that. But it's something to keep an eye on. So in this situation, we'll just raise this whole thing up. Contacts, they moved a little bit when I changed the crown. Nice and broad. Okay. Okay, perfect. Now we can cut. Drop down. Check contact. Probably still a little bulky here on this buckle. But it's not too bad. Maybe just a hair. Bring it in just a little bit. There. Alright. Perfect. And that'll do it. So, um, you guys have any questions, comments, concerns? How I do certain things? Sometimes I go through those things way too fast, and it being Monday morning, a little fuzzy from a long weekend. Um, let me know what you guys think. Hit that thumbs up button, hit subscribe. See you next time.